Hey buddies, welcome back to Venomous Gaming Entertainment and I'm bringing you Dark Souls Remastered for the PS4, but obviously I'm playing it on the PlayStation 5. I haven't played this game since, what, 2011, 12, when the game was released, you know? Obviously I completed the game back then, I didn't go for the Platinum Trophy back then, but um, I might go for it this time around though, I, I, I don't know. It'd be interesting to see how different this game is to the one that was released back in 2011-12, whichever year it was. Okay, so this is my character. Um, so there's my name, obviously, uh, Class Warrior. I picked the gift. Um, I picked the Master Key as the gift, as the Master Key opens every single lock in the game. Um, yeah, this is my character, so let's do this shit, man. Um, accept. Okay, to start a game with this character. Yes, it is. Let's do this. In the age of ancients, the world was unformed, shrouded by fog. A land of grey crags, arch trees, and everlasting dragons. But then there was fire, and with fire, came disparity, heat and cold, life and death, and of course, light and dark. Then from the dark, they came and found the souls of lords within the flame. Nito, the first of the dead. The witch of Isolith and her daughters of chaos. Gwyn, the Lord of Sunlight, and his faithful knights, and the furtive pygmy, so easily forgotten. With the strength of lords, they challenge the dragons. Wind's mighty bolts peeled apart their stone skins. The witches weaved great firestorms. Nito unleashed a miasma of death and disease. And Seath the scales betrayed his own, and the dragons were no more. But soon the flames will fade, and only dark will remain. Even now, there are only embers. And man sees not light, but only endless nights. And amongst the living are seen Carriers of the accursed dark side. Yes, indeed. The dark sign brands the undead. And 
and in this land, the undead are corralled and led to the north. Where they are locked away to await the end of the world. Okay, so the first thing I'll point out is that the graphics are definitely improved. Okay, dungeon cell key. The graphics are definitely improved over the original back um, 10 years ago. That is for certain. Look at this. It reminds me kind of um, the new Demon Souls, I think. I wonder if I can get in there. Hold on. Oh, yeah, so these tell you the buttons, I should imagine. Okay, R1 to attack. But I'm not going to... I mean, I could attack these guys, but... I don't really see the point in attacking them. Okay, but the Soulsborne games are my favourite kind of games, so I was thinking that maybe I should um upload Dark Souls 2. I don't know. Because I've done Bloodborne, Dark Souls 3, Elden Ring. I'm doing this one here now. And I've forgotten where to go, I haven't played this game in ages, so um, Okay, that's a, that's a bonfire there. Now, if I remember correctly, there's a boss battle through those doors. And there's a gate here. Okay, it doesn't open from that side. Okay, so holding circle and up is the run button. If I remember, what I need to do is to run from this battle. It's funny, I can hear his footsteps, the boss, but I can't see the boss. I don't know if there's some kind of glitch, but I don't think it is. I think he, I think he's just ready to drop down. I'm going to run towards the gate, because, uh... Oh, shit. <laughs> no, that's the end of that bell. But don't worry, what I'm going to do, I know the way to kill him. Well, sort of. I think you have to drop down from above. Uh, let me just light this bonfire. Okay, you need to go that way there. Yeah, it plays. Yeah, I'm just trying to get a proper feel for it right now. Okay, nice, got a heater shield. Let me just equip the shield. How do I do that? Um. Right, okay, so change equipment. Shield there. Right, okay, that's the same button. I'm looking for a sword though, man, like a long sword or something, because I can't... Where the fuck is this guy going? What a coward. Oh, nice, got a long sword. Okay, let me... <coughs> Equip that. Sweet. Look how nice the graphics look, though. <coughs> yeah, there you are. Then if you can backstab, yes. Oh, it's interesting. Because <clears throat> I got the backstab on him. However, though, there, there was no epic sound to the game. No epic sound to the backstab. Uh, yes, an ordinary stab in the back. <laughs> yeah, usually the fog gates in Dark Souls 2, 3, Elden Ring signify... um boss battles and things. Um just trying to back out a bit of go. Let me go this way. 
Okay, is there nothing down here? I've forgotten, are there any hidden paths in this game or not? Okay, how do you, yeah, how do you jump? That's the... Right, okay. Just trying to... Get a feel for the buttons. Oh, right, yeah, you can back step, right, okay. That's the bonfire that I lit before. No, oh, 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 hold on a minute, there's a boulder that runs down here, isn't there? There it is at the top. <laughs> so, what is here? Absolutely nothing. Oh, nice, I can open here. But I. Hold on. Oh, this is the shortcut back to the bonfire, right, okay. Let's, uh... Right, okay, so what did this unlock? No? Nope. Look at that, that's the same guy from the cutscene. What the fuck happened to this guy? Because literally, like, five minutes ago, he was getting me out of my cell, and now look at him, trapped behind a wall. How the fuck did he even get it? Oh, you. <clears throat> You're no hollow. Thank goodness. I'm done for, I'm afraid. I'll die soon, then lose my sanity. I wish to ask something of you. You and I, we're both undead. Hear me out, will you? Yeah, go on. Regrettably, I have failed in my mission. But perhaps you can keep the torch lit. There is an old saying in my family. Thou who art undead art chosen. In thine exodus from the undead asylum, maketh pilgrimage to the land of ancient lords. When thou ringeth the bell of awakening, the fate of the undead thou shalt know. Well, now you know, and I can die with hope in my heart. Oh, one more thing. Here, take this. An Estus flask, an undead favorite. Oh, sweet, nice. Oh, take this. <coughs> Okay, under the silent key. Now I must bid farewell. I would hate to harm you after death. So go now. And thank you. Okay, so this dude's coming back a zombie, man. <laughs> Where's Leon and Joe Valentine when now you need him? I must bid farewell. I would hate to harm you after death. Okay, he's just saying the same. Shizzle. <clears throat> How he got in here, I have no idea. Unless there's an opening in the roof or something, like perhaps there above me. But what the hell was he fighting? Maybe that boss that I'm now going to beat. Which is up here. Yeah, this doesn't have the same sounds to it as a... DS2, DS3 and Elden Ring, that's for certain. But I suppose it was the first one. Let me just look for some hidden ice, hidden paths. I don't, I don't, I don't think there are any hidden paths around here. Oh shit. No, two hits and these guys are done for. With, the, with my trusty long sword, man. <laughs> okay, this is where you go to the fog gate, drop in, beat the boss. Let me just see what's around this corner here. Okay, this guy looks... Okay, yeah, it gave me more souls, it looked tougher. Can I open it? No, I can't. This, this one says luck, but how is that possible? I, ha I have the master key. I suppose it doesn't... Oh, it's a deadbolt, isn't it? So it's not a... Is it a hidden path? Nope. No, just checking. <laughs> I haven't played this in ages, I've forgotten. Okay, I need to... Um, right, okay. I'm just testing out some of these buttons, right. Um. Right, that's how to roll. It's an okay roll. It's, it feels kind of slow to me, though. <clears throat> okay, let's go and beat this boss, hopefully.
I'm in deep concentration mode here. <laughs> nice. Beam first time, baby. Big Pilgrim's Key. And how many souls do you get for beating this guy? Okay, I got a humanity. Well, I can still hear somebody standing on the floor, like as if they're thumping their. as if they're big and heavy. Okay, so I got 2,000 souls just for being him. I think you go for here now. Okay, got the key. Now, if I remember correctly, um, dun -dun 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 -dun, I think there's some eggs over here. No. Okay, where are they? Ah, that's where they are. These are these little birds that I talk to you, where you can give them items and... You, you, give me warm, give me soft. Once you leave this area, you can't come back here for a while. Um, and then you can give them items, and then they give you, well, basically they give you other items in return. But I did like that view though, look at the view of the mountains. That's pretty fucking cool, I think. Okay, there's nothing more to see in this area here. I think I just need to walk to the edge. <clears throat> Only in the ancient legends it is stated that one day an undead shall be chosen. the undead asylum in pilgrimage to the land of the ancient lords Lordran Okay, in Lordran, level up and kindle that bonfire, that's right, okay. <coughs> okay, can that kindle while hollowed? Um, reverse hollowing? No humanity, right, okay, uh, yeah. Just trying to get a grips on this well, whole thing. What do we have here? You must be a new arrival. Let me guess, fate of the undead, right? But there's no salvation here. You'd have done better to rot in the undead asylum. Huh. Too late now. <sighs> well, since you're here, let me help you out. There are actually two bells of awakening. One's up above in the undead church. The other is far, far below, in the ruins at the base of Blight Town. Ring them both, and something happened. Brilliant, right? Not much to go on. But I have a feeling that won't stop you. So, off you go. It is why you came, isn't it? To this accursed land, the undead? <laughs> well, actually, I forgot all about ringing the tree bells, so... Your face. <coughs> Tell me all about it. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to exhaust his dialogue and just... Ooh, what? Restoring your humanity? Well, there are a few ways to go about it. Collect it bit by bit from corpses. Or you can butter up a cleric and get yourself summoned. And the quickest way, although I never do it, is to kill a healthy undead and pillage its humanity. Coveting my neighbor is only human, after all. <laughs> what are you looking at? Don't try anything clever. You might regret it. 
But this guy here, he speaks so quiet though. <coughs> oh, that's all we need. Another inquisitive song. Well, listen carefully then. One of the bands is up above in the undead impact. Yeah, he said that. The other band is back down below the undead bird. Within the plague infested. Blight town. Die again before I step foot in that set. <laughs> Bloody hell, what is you ask? <laughs> is that all he says now, or is that? Mm -hmm. I'm not up for chatting. <coughs> <coughs> okay, so where do I go now? Okay, got humanity, nice. I've forgotten. I think maybe I go up here to continue the main quest line. Yes, it is, I remember that. Hold on, did he follow me? No, we didn't. Right, okay. Not like that. Then I'm just trying to. I'm just gonna have a little wander around this little area because I, I know there's a good couple of items to acquire. Right, you got this area here. Oh, what's this? No response. She cannot speak. Oh, reinforce SS talk. No response. She cannot speak. I don't know why I picked talk. Okay, that's where I can reinforce my Estes class. I'm just trying to see what's further down here as well. Um, wow, oh, right, where is this? Did I get a torch or something? Um, uh, maybe not. But if I remember correctly though, there is the... Where the fuck am I now? Okay, I would drop down, but I don't want to drop down in any sort of... and put myself in danger, so... Because uh, that would just be crazy! <laughs> okay, whatever this is, I'm gonna get it. Okay, so... Okay, so I've got a soul packet. Now, yeah, let me just kill this fool. Oh, I tried to get the backstab, but uh Where my new Londo ruins? But right, I think I'm here before my time to be honest. <clears throat> the enemies here are pretty weak still. You know, dying in like one or two swings at the sword. Just kill these fools. Just trying to remember something if I can. Just kill this guy a minute. Oh, there's an item here. Is it this way that I go? Yeah, I think there's an item. There's an item that you want to get earlier on in the game, which transcendent curse. What the hell is that? Okay, temporary curse allows engagement with ghosts. Oh right, there's ghosts in this area. Right, okay, let me just um. I think there's an item here that I want to get, if I remember. No, hold on, I think I've gone the wrong way, to be fair. Okay, I think the item boosts my SS recovery or something. No, no, I still haven't played this in ages. <laughs> no, already I'm loving the game though, man, it's Dark Souls, so... It's absolutely fantastic. Or is it this way I need to go? And go further down, I think. No, it's not. But there's a... Oh, look at that, there's someone in there. Hmm? 
this is unusual. You haven't lost your head. And more importantly, you're free. How on earth? Well, I shouldn't pry. I'm Ricky at Vinheim. I was once an established smith, but look at me now. Can you believe it? Yeah, kind of talk to him a bit more. Have you? Oh no. Don't worry. I've no intention of escaping. It's safe here. I can't bear the thought of going hollow out there. Although, I must admit, I've not much to occupy myself. How about this? I could forge your weapons, albeit with rather minimal tools. I'll show you what made me the best in this. Okay, so we've got like a weaponsmith right here then. Oh nice, I can purchase soul arrows and things like that from him. Oh, so I can purchase spells from this guy and he can reinforce my weapons and things. Right, okay. Smithing helps soothe my nerves. Don't let me wither away out of idleness. Don't worry, buddy. I won't. I'm just trying to remember. Cause there's an item that I want to pick up from now. Hold on. Is that the way? Oh, this is the way I came. Is it? I can't even fucking remember. I'm all twisted around. Ooh, what's this? Use the master. Valley of Drew. No, I don't want to come here yet, but let me get this though. Doesn't hurt. <laughs> no, I'm too under level for this right now. But there's still an item that I want to get. Let me just go exploring just a little bit. This is not the way to go, by the way. Well, it is, but not for now. Just trying to remember where to go down here. Um Ah, I think I remember now. Hold on. Just going to ignore the ghosts that are in this area. Yeah, it's right down here. That's it. This allows me to... Oh, shit. But that's okay, though, because the main thing is I picked up the item. That means I can reinforce my Estus Flash straight away. But I do need to get that myself, though. Otherwise, without getting back my souls, I don't think I can pay the Firekeeper to reinforce my Estus fast, I think. Okay, where's the lever? There we go. Ah, oh, thinking it's Elden Ring, pressing triangle. It's not triangle anymore, man, it's X now. Look at my character though, man. I look like I'm <laughs> like I'm a hundred years old. <laughs> no. What I really need is like a torch or something, I think. Let me just kill this guy just in case he uh, comes alive and tries to stab me in the back as I'm crossing the bridge. <laughs> I wouldn't want that to happen. Right, there's my souls. I can see them over there. Right, get the souls and then move on. Right. Hopefully, I can survive to get them. It's only a small amount of souls, so I don't really need them, need them. But at this point in the game, it doesn't hurt to... Oh my god. 
What the fuck? I'm just trying to... I, I, I can just see now, this whole video is going to be nothing but trying to get back these damn... Green looking songs. That's what this video is, you know, it's going to be nothing but getting back these songs. <laughs> okay, I'll try one more time and then I might have to... End the video and then... Get the souls and then load an another video but paste it all together so it looks like one big video. <laughs> <clears throat> not triangle, it's not Elden Ring, man. Now, I think that's the point for Elden Ring. I don't know, I haven't played that game in a good while now. Alright, let's do this yet again. Yeah, if it, if it doesn't work out this time, what I'll do, I'll end the video and then... Well, to you guys, it won't really look like much, it would just be, uh... That I was here one minute and someplace else the next. What I want to know though is why don't the souls just <clears throat> respawn right where I died rather than at the very end making me run all the way back down that pathway where if you fall off you're dead. You know, I mean... Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Have the souls right there. That's a lot bloody better. That's where they should have been the very, the very first time, you know? Man, it's so dark here. I can barely see anything at all. Um, not that way, I think it's this way I need to go. Nice, let's reinforce the Estus. <coughs> That's what I say. Nice, Estus reinforced. Wait, oh my god, hold on, I mean, I've got 10 Estus flash. How did I get 10? I started off with only 5. How on earth I got 10? Is fucking bizarre. I have no idea. But I certainly know there's an area. Um, oh no, can I go in the water? Yes, I can. I thought I was going to die there for a second. I was like... Well, right, good, I can't. Hold on. Is that... I thought it was a chest I could open, but no. I'm just looking around for any items before I move on. I know this part of the game seems absolutely boring, but um, exploration is key to finding shit. Right, okay, time to do a mega run. Yeah, I'll probably die half a dozen fucking times. No, I'm dodging them all like fucking Goku and Vegeta. <laughs> Do 
Because ideally, what you want to do, you want to do a run. It's not the way to go where the skeletons are, but there are some useful items over in that direction, so... I will have to go again. Because <clears throat> I think I need to run a little further deeper and there's a couple more items to get. So let's do that shit right now. I'll probably die a couple times doing this. To be fair, so... You know, it's funny because I'm not even really going for items in this playthrough, it's just... <laughs> Look at the amount of damage. <clears throat> I'm not aiming to fight these. It's just the items that I want. Quest of Autorius. Oh yeah, the Dark Souls Remaster comes with the DLC built into it, which is really cool. Okay, which... I'm getting a little lost here. Huh? This is the way to go. I want back my souls, man. I want back my souls. All the way down there by my souls. I didn't even die there. That's what really annoys me sometimes with this thing. I didn't even die there, but... That's where my songs are. That makes kind of like no sense. Oh, what's down here? Hold on. <clears throat> you know, this is probably not a good direction to go in, but uh, fuck it anyway. No, nope, Mrs. Skellington's turning back. Look at that half of them are fucking dying. Okay, the catacombs not go this way. Jesus, I need to run because uh, the enemies down in this location are far too powerful. Come on, I'm trying to run past these fools. I can't even run back. Right, if I can just... Oh my god. No, I want back my souls. I'm not playing, man. <laughs> not messing around. I want them back. I don't think there's any other items to gather around here. Yes, there they are. Good, right here as well. Right near the entrance to me. To, to the catacombs. That's good. Now, will I make it back alive? Probably not. No, so far so good. I say. So. And I think I'm missing something here at Fire Link Shrine as well, though. Uh, what happens if I go... I definitely think I'm missing something. I know... Um... I think there's an NPC somewhere. Yeah, there he is. 
Look at his shield though, it looks so nice. Hello there. I believe we are not acquainted. I am Petrus of Thoroughland. Have you business with us? If not, I prefer to keep a distance, if possible. Hello there. I realize that I have requested that we retain our distance. But I also want you to know that it is not meant in ill will. Here, take this as a token of peace. No, go ahead. It's for you. Okay, a couple coin. Oh my. <coughs> you again. Oh, I know. How about this? I have to await my companions here anyway. So what if I were to teach you some miracles? Would that please you? Yeah, I guess, but I'm not going to learn any. Very well. What do you have, though? Join Covenant? Yeah, why not? Can't hurt. Yeah, the video's like over 40 minutes in length now, and all I've done is... Only their ultimate effectiveness will be determined by your efforts and your faith. Yeah, that I gathered. I'm not really a faith user. Okay, time to go to the main, on the main pathway now. I'm just trying to figure out which way it is. And all this, it, it, it all just blends right in that I just get a bit confused and everything just is the same. Right, come on in. Look at that, and there's an item over there as well, which I'm gonna get, hopefully. Oh shit! Uh, oh, okay, let's take on you first. Whoa! Double teaming! Okay, can I make this? Yes! Okay, now this can be a bit tricky. You need to aim, you need to angle yourself towards the wall. Okay, ring of sacrifice. Okay, all that does is, uh. <clears throat> if I remember correctly, when you die, you don't lose your souls. Instead, the ring takes the hit for you. Nice. Now there should be a rat in the next part, and the rats in this game they can drop humanity. However, though the odds of them doing that they are low. Ah, look, I hit him, and it didn't even register. Like, okay, song of the lost dead. There's a way. Okay, that doesn't open from that side, so it is this location I need to go. Whoa! This guy moved like fucking Goku, man. Like. <laughs> I tried to get the backstab on that guy, but it didn't actually work. Oh no, how does the video? 45 minutes, that's not too bad. I don't want to make it too long, so what? Oh no. I know there's an area just there. Oh. That's not good. Nice. What's happened to the 
in game music. There was music, but then but now there's no music. Or maybe I'm too used to um Dark Souls two, three, Out of the Ring and things, and there was no music in Dark Souls one. By God, I'm being manhandled here. Okay, I just picked up some rubbish. <laughs> I don't know how good the rubbish is going to be. I think it's just as the name suggests it is. You know, I miss the music, but also I don't because it goes to show you just the eeriness of how, of what the, you know, it's just footsteps, shields and swords, that's all you hear, the clanging of metal, and it's like, silence. Everything's so hard to see. I could just about make out the stairs there. <laughs> you really do have to keep an eye out. Okay, I can't go that way. Okay, I think this is this area all complete. I mean, if I didn't die so many times in the skeletons and whatever else, I would have been um, a bit further into the into the area. Okay, there's an item there, and I can go up here. What's up here first? Okay, it's not a boss battle here, shouldn't be. But it better not be. That's good. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm not aiming to pick up every single item in the game or something, that's a... Uh... Okay, I can drop down there, that takes me back round. And what's up here? the fuck is that? <clears throat> oh, it's the dragon! Look at that. Oh yeah, you, you, you can cut off the dragon's tail and then get the drake sword, which is an awesome weapon by the way, which is what I'm trying to aim to do as well. But to do that, you need to find a merchant that sells you a bow and arrow. No, but that's, that's, that shows you it, yeah. Alright, come on then. Let's do this. Nice. Can I open this door? Yes, I can. Is there anything in it? Oh, there's this. Yeah, wooden shield. Okay, nice. I want to take out this archer guy, man, because he's really... Oh, shit. I just stood there and took that like a... Back in India. Nice. 
Bonfire. Okay, so I cannot go that way. Who the fuck is throwing that shit? Trying to get the backstab on these guys, but it didn't seem to like work. Look how well hidden some of these pathways are. I know there's a merchant around here somewhere. Yeah, there's the merchant. Let me just see what's around this other corner. Nope. Let me just heal. Where does this ladder actually take me? I don't think I remember this from the first one. I mean from like 10 years ago. Oh, there's an item right here. Okay, throwing knife, sweet. Oh, look at that, there's a jump right there. Well, let's do it. Okay, don't want to go down just yet. What's up? Oh nice, light crossbow, standard bolt. I think that's all this area was, it's just leading you to get the crossbow and things, right? Oh yeah, that's it's uh this location over here, isn't it, with the merchant. What you need to do with the merchant is buy the I'll buy these I will buy these items now, hold on. Okay, so the video's about fifty four minutes in length. Uh, yeah, let me buy these items well, now. You seem to have your wits of thing I try <laughs> Well you wanna buy you wanna buy the Well buy this as well, write messages and things. Um why not, it doesn't matter. <clears throat> Dried Finger reminds me of Elden Ring, and that's 2,000 songs. Uh, I'm not buying that right now, though. Rather come to buy. Where's the short bow? There we go. Let me buy that. Now I'm gonna buy a whole bunch of these standard arrows. How do I just? Isn't there a way to increase by 10? No, there isn't, is there? I'm gonna buy 100 of these. Make it 101. There we go. Now this guy also sounds like chain armor and things like that. He also sounds other items as well. But I don't have the souls to get those, and you don't really need them to complete the game anyway. Thank you kindly. You're welcome. Okay.
I definitely get turned around in this area, that's for certain. Uh, which way do I go now? Hold on, I think it's... Yeah, back this way, right. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to end the video now, because in the next video what I'm going to do, I'm going to go in that direction there and hopefully take on the dragon, well, no, we're not fight the dragon, but at least get the dragon, the great sword anyway. Okay, guys. Peace out.